Hello, good morning everyone. So, today in this video on DB2, I'm going to show you about how a select command works with the different options. So, in this, I'm going to show you what is a distinct, what is a in, and what is a not in, and where, and when we have to use it in a query, and how powerful it will be while doing an application program or while uh, testing any table queries, okay? So, let me connect to the mainframe system, and I'm connected to the DB2 subsystem on the mainframe, and I'm going to show you a distinct uh, query using select command, okay? So, now, anyhow, you know about the table I have created like select query star from EMP underscore table one which is a table I have created and let's see the data what it has so you can see a various employee employee name and salaries whose range is between uh, 50,000 75,000 and some of them are having the same salaries here 40,000 is uh, having by Rahim and Pooja is also a having 40,000 both of them belongs to the same uh, QA QA team and uh, us other them have uh, so and you can see a kill robot also have the same salaries so just I wanted to view a uh, salaries uh, with a distinct unique salaries like 50,000 60,000 I don't want to see a duplicate values here okay so in order to see that how do we write it right so just go back to the query panel and just give select distinct and which one you want to see select the field you wanted to see select EMP salary from EMP table right then run it if you run this just you can see only a distinct salaries it has so in order to give a more idea so what I will do is just we will select only a e salary and see how many records it will fetch okay uh, it is fetching around nine records right it has fetched around nine records from this particular table so when I use this uh, when I use distinct keyword so your results will be different it will display only a specific unique records right so in this way uh, distinct will work and this is very powerful so whenever you have a lot of details where will be a dis duplicates and if you want to eliminate those duplicate records when a client transmits uh, data to your DB2 table or someone if you are transmitting back to the Sun Downstream systems so you can use the distinct and which is very powerful Okay, so now we are going to look at about n operator. So how, what is an n operator and what is a not n operator? So, uh, for example, um, you have uh, an employee. So this in this table, just like uh, as you can see, there are only nine records. So you might have a situation like where there are millions of records, and uh, you want to fetch only specific five records or six records. Then reading all the records is a waste of time, right? So you can select a specific records what you want from that specific large volume of table how do we do that so select star okay select star from um, table table is EMP one uh, where uh, I wanted to select a few specific employee I employees where I know their employee IDs and I wanted to see the specific information for example the uh, one employee has been joined four years back and uh, he has done various certifications and uh, he got uh, he got and he wanted to I wanted to see the history of those particular employees so what are the certification has been done how the salary has been incremented how he ha got hike in different uh, in this five years and what is age and uh, various other properties I want to see those particular employee details I don't want to fetch all the employee details I wanted to specifically extract those particular uh, employees details okay where employee ID okay employee ID n and I know the employee IDs okay the first is employee ID 1 and I also wanted to see employee ID he is having a good salary just we want to see the information of it and then good run the query if you run the query okay something hanged up okay so something is a problem with the query here so maybe it has been disconnected I will come back 